Come, he was running and he come to this just like a three or four foot drop and he must have not gone into or miscalculated. He had to come asleep from Where are we going? Well, I was just going to ask you, where do you want to go? I'm going to go right over here. One thing I don't want to do is lose that overboard. So are we fishing home turf? We're fishing home turf today. productive morning. Yeah, well, hey, could be worse. So I guess we're going to try another lake over. Yeah, it could be worse. Could be working. Yeah, it could be working. So we'll go try another spot and see how that works out. Well, that was fruitless. <laughs> Not even a strike. Not even a strike ball. Catch. White perch. Oh. Dreaded white perch. Yeah. Some people would love that. Yeah, they're, yeah. Yeah, we're not one of We're not some people, are we? Well, fishing wasn't quite as good as we'd hoped. But, you know, we wanted to fish some new water. It's good to get out in some new water. We got three mediocre brook trout and caught a few white perch too. Uh, but we kind of wanted to fish our home water. You don't necessarily have to catch a pile of fish to call the trip a success. It does help, but you know, it was a good day. So I do want to make mention that we do keep some fish to eat. I'm big into anti-inflammatory diets. Cold water species of fish have fats that are high in omega-3 fatty acids. So anti-inflammatory, good fats for you. We're pretty limited on what we can find in the local stores up here for wild caught fish. So the important thing is wild caught fish have the correct ratio of omega-3s to omega-6 fatty acids. Omega-6 fatty acids are pro-inflammatory. So in wild caught fish, that ratio of omega-3 to omega-6 fatty acids is usually a one to four ratio. But the problem lies in farm raised salmon has a skewed ratio of omega-3s to omega-6s. So uh, Farm-raised salmon can have as high as 14 times the amount of omega-6 fatty acids. Wild fish, cold water species of fish, are very good for you. Anytime I'm fishing and I catch a fish, it doesn't. It, 
tends not to be the largest fish, but we do keep some fish. Yeah, that's as wild as it, as it gets. Uh, that's right down to nature. So eating what you caught kind of ties in everything together. It's kind of that natural cycle of things. I love to fish, I love to hunt, and I think it's just as important to eat what I hunt and what I fish. It's about the healthiest stuff you can get. Same thing with venison. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that. You're not gonna find that stuff in a store. Uh, you're not gonna find anything like that in the store. So until next time, get outside. It's good for the soul.